Welcome back. A skills academy in Johannesburg is using the popular video game Minecraft to teach young children about coding. Now, one way of thinking about Minecraft is that it's just one massive bunch of virtual Lego. It's one of the most popular games in the world with nearly 75 million users every month. CGT and Simitra Naidu filed this story for Grassroots tonight. Flora Maduma, a young South African IT specialist, left the corporate world to teach children about coding. And she's using the popular game Minecraft to do that. It becomes so difficult when you are trying to say to a child, you know, we are dealing today with um, underwater creatures. Now they have to now visualize that and try and create those pictures in their heads. And they create different pictures. Some don't even have those pictures because they might not have even seen what a seal looks like. Now with Minecraft, such pieces of work becomes so easy. Minecraft transports users to different worlds. Children use pixelated blocks to create anything their imagination allows. Unknowingly, children are developing their organizational and fine motor skills. We're learning how to build and do Minecraft and like, download our own games and play. I like building houses and I love and I love playing around building cool stuff which I can feel like when I grow up I'm going to do this house and I love um, meeting stuff which I never seen and fighting monsters. I've played Minecraft for a long period of time, I think it's been three to four years now but this is my first time doing Minecraft Education Edition. Um, I've actually learned a lot so far, um, for example I've learned to be much more creative in what I do, um, just express my mind. Minecraft is a digital version of the iconic Lego blocks and is based on the same concept to improve constructive and lateral thinking. We do Lego education where we're teaching kids how to do robotics and it's also another way of coding. They've got programs that they build into the robots where they have to create certain patterns, they have to create certain beeps, there's colors that you know they, they become creative with. So there's teamwork, there's collaboration, which is a very critical skill in a workplace. There's um, leadership, because we also create leaders to say you will lead the project. And there is also what we call um, citizenship, where they become responsible citizens. Maduma's dream doesn't end there. The QBT course is aligned with the local school curriculum. The tech entrepreneur wants to take the academy into public schools and disadvantaged communities. She's now working on funding. Sumitra Nadu, CGT and Johannesburg, South Africa.